Hello everyone, we are hooking study space for the future. And so we're a group of LSA students and engineering students that came up with a uh, solution to a problem that, you know, some may overlook a lot of the time. Because of course, we have the biggest issue with, um, you know, college in general is mixing independence of the students with um, cleanliness and safety of the general community. And so Michigan does a great job, but we believe that we could um, help solve two particular areas. One was study spaces and the other were doors because, you know, doors are really a pivotal um, area for students and a pivotal, you know, means of transportation and um, sectioning off in architecture, but they're also a place where um, bacteria and viruses hide for numerous um, hours or even minutes that could possibly harm students in the long run. So what we did to solve that problem was PP packets, but in particular, we came up with this idea called the hook. Now, when we were figuring out the hook, we realized that we wanted to make sure we had something that a student could hold continuously um, and clean easily to grip doors of all, um, just of everything you know, just all range and all sizes. And so this idea was um, cheap because we could easily use Michigan plastics and metals um, from other resources to create. And it was also quite effective because we thought of possibly using hand sanitizer in the actual handle to promote um, further cleanliness of the student and of the um, door itself. And so we really utilize this idea of creating adjustable hooks that can pop out easily with, you know, flip, flip, flick of a wrist or um, flip of a button that could hook on. And then we also implemented a nozzle for either hand sanitizer or pressing buttons. And so with this, we can create a um, better way for students to um, you know, open doors without possibly infecting themselves or even others. And so we had a general timeline of um, implementing this and creating it throughout the rest of July and then finally um, producing it in August and then sending it out um, before school starts to every everyone in the um, dorms and outside of the dorms if possible. Of course, we most likely will have to sell them, but um, this offers a great possibility, uh, possible benefit to everyone in university.